Hey everybody, Darlene here at Petal Academy. Thanks so much for tuning in to our Flower Fact Friday. Today we're going to be talking about the Ranunculus Bloom. And these little babies are definitely one of our favorites. Just going to show that close up. Look at that beautiful tissue-like appeal on these blooms. They're just gorgeous. This one is a white variety that has been dyed um, into a mauve tone. So they don't naturally come this color, unfortunately. Um, but they do come in whites, creams, yellows, oranges, peaches, blush, reds, and into the plum tones into the fall. Typically, they are a spring flower, but we do seem to be seeing them kind of year round because they're a very popular wedding flower. So it's kind of hard to pronounce, called ranunculus. You can see it's beautiful uh, breaks on the stem. So it's kind of fun to use for design work because you can use these little shoots as well as the blooms. Um, they just are amazing. And they open up quite lovely. Longevity wise, you're gonna get between seven and 14 days out of these typically. They like to be in a small amount of water. That's a really important tip. They do not like to have water up to their necks. So they like to be in a low amount of water. They've got a fuzzy stem. One thing to think about when you're looking at flowers and you see this fuzzy stem, that's usually a good indicator that you're not supposed to soak them in a lot of water. So roses typically like a lot of water because they've got a woody stem and they like to be fully hydrated. Ranunculus like to be in a lower amount of water. So usually I fill the vase but a quarter full and just have the bottom quarter of the stem kind of into the water. We usually remove all of the foliage that would be sitting in that water level so that'll cut down on the bacteria. Another thing that they enjoy is um, a little bit of preservative in that water. So you're gonna put your preservative in, lukewarm water, trim them, and they should last between seven and 14 days. When they open up, uh, you're gonna see this middle kind of evolve a little bit more, and they are related to the buttercup. So that is why you can kind of see the foliage is really, really similar to a buttercup if you can find them in the wild. They also come in a butterfly variety, so check our videos coming up on those in the future. Um, butterfly ranunculus is also a beautiful bloom. They're a little bit more open, a little bit more of the center is showing. But this variety here is a clony ver variety. So it's a gorgeous, beautiful, single bloom stem typically with these little side shoots. So thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe below and be sure to check out petalacademy.com for all things floral. Thanks so much. Until next time, live life in full bloom.